G'day Magpie fans, Steve Curry here. Look, it's a very exciting day for me. Uh, Eddie Maguire, the president of the Collingwood Football Club, is over in London. As a result, the job has befallen me to become president for a day. So I think I'm pretty well uh, equipped. There's not really many differences between me and Eddie. He's about an inch taller. That's pretty much it. He used to steal cars. Uh, I've never stolen a car. So that's two major differences. I might even show you quickly uh, characterisation. Okay, here's me. How you going? This is me. Here's Eddie. You ready? <coughs> How you going? I'm Eddie. See? And it's, it's me again. All right, Gina Reinhardt. I'm very, very rich. Me again. Come on in with me and we're going to go to the President's Club. I never eat lunch anywhere that hasn't got my name above the door, so let's go. Yeah, I'm president today. Oh, I'm president. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they like everyone laughs when I say I'm president today, but pretty incredible, isn't it? And it's not broady enough. No, isn't it? It's oh, right, all right. You okay. should have been wearing moccasins. <laughs> Are you hearing this, Eddie? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, he's made it. So please, everyone, welcome Eddie Maguire for getting up and getting here today. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, I am the president of the Collingwood Football Club. But uh, you're all my friends today, so we should dispense with the formalities and you can merely call me El Presidente. Now, Collingwood and Hawthorne, ladies and gentlemen, share a rich history, not just on the ground, where we've had some ding-dong battles, but off the ground as well. And speaking of ding-dong, I fondly remember the day that we stole Dermot Brereton from you. <laughs> and I also remember slightly less fondly the next day when we realised why you were so happy to let him go. <laughs> as I always say, may neither the umpire nor injury play a part in the result of today's game. Floriot Pika, may the magpies flourish and like soldiers in a glue fight, side by side we stick together. Thank you very much. Look, I just want to go down there and just make sure the boys are comfortable. Just, they just go out there and just play it like any other game. It's like playing, I don't know, for the Q Rovers, 1982. It doesn't matter if there's 85,000 people or just my dad and some weirdo in an overcoat. Oh, here they come now. Here are my boys. You watch them listen to me. This is a real deal. Check this out. All right. I used to live with Dorsey. Come on, boys. I think he winked at me. I'm pretty sure he winked at me. Stevic and Bannister and away we go to get things started at the MCG round 17. He finds a skipper inside 50, a long ball, Bruce provides a shepherd and the Hawks have got three. Cyril over the top, he goes to Young, Young will run into the goal, give it to Ruffy, Ruffy will send it through. He's got two and the Hawks are out to 20. So in the end, a sensational performance by the Hawks. Well, turns out we didn't win the game, but uh, no, look, you know, what can I do? Eddie, we tried, we uh, failed. Please come home soon. Thank you. Good on you, Steve. I'll leave you with one week, one game to look after while I go overseas and look what happens. Thankfully, I'll be back in harness very shortly. I'm here at the Tour de France, and I've got Luke Ball, our champion footballer, recovering from his knee reconstruction with me. G'day, Ballie. G'day, Ed. Yeah, great to be here. And uh, you flew over with pie in the sky on the mighty Emirates, direct into Dubai, straight into Paris. Beautiful trip. I did. When I went and saw the girls at the front desk at pie in the sky, I thought, girls, I'm starting to, get a, starting to do my head in a bit. I need to get away for a couple of weeks, but I couldn't have imagined that I'd end up here about to ride down the Champs-Élysées with you, and um, what a special place it is. With the Orica Green Edge team, and they've had a fantastic uh, tour, their first tour to France. Being here with some of the great professional athletes, uh, what are you picking up? A lot of the recovery stuff is quite unique, isn't it? It is. I mean, and we watch it from afar back home. Obviously, we stay up late and, and watch it and, and just marvel at the, the achievements of these athletes. And um, when you get to see, see them in, you know, in person, and, and we've had Robbie McEwen take us around, 
um, you just realise how fit they are. And, um, you know, we like, we like to think we train pretty hard, but these guys are almost at another level. So it's, a, it's an amazing experience to be able to um, yeah, go around with these guys and see how they go about it. Fingers crossed, uh, Cracker and McCaffer are coming along nicely with their recovery. How are you going? Yeah, I'm going really well. I've been uh, just over uh, three months now and haven't had any setbacks and back running. So... Um, and doing a bit of riding, so um, yeah, going really well. And those two guys have been sensational. Um, you know, they were a couple of months ahead of me, but they've been really inspirational the way they've attacked their rehab. And fingers crossed, they can get back and have an impact in the finals for us. And just freshening up your mind as much as anything else after the disappointment of doing your knee, having the operation, the pain, and the early recovery stage. How, how important is this just to get a bit of away and freshen your head up? Yeah, absolutely. That's what it was about. And you know, thanks so much to the club for, for allowing me to get away for a couple of couple of weeks. And as you said, freshen the mind up. It's it's not much. Fun sitting and watching in when you're training all week with the guys but you don't get that release for the weekend so um, obviously the timing's worked out pretty well I'll catch a bit of the tour and maybe a bit of, a bit of the Olympics so I'm uh, really thankful for, thankful for the club for letting me um, have this um, opportunity. What do you like on the bike? Oh not bad I've been doing a little bit obviously I haven't been able to run for, for, for a couple of months so I've been on the bike a fair bit so um, I don't know how I'd go up the mountains, but uh, I think today we're pretty we're on a pretty, pretty flat stage, so I should be able to cope it. Well, mate, let's get out there, OK? Give it a calling with spirit. We've got to recover from the loss to Hawthorne last Absolutely. week, so let's go up there and give it to us. One of us is a finely tuned professional athlete, <laughs> and one of us isn't. You see if you can figure out which, which one it is. All right, Paulie, let's go. Come on. G'day. We're down at uh, Vic Park on set of the Masashi ad that me and a few of the boys are about to film. So it's me, Heath, Steele and Harry. Um, I'm not sure I've ever acted before, but hopefully we can get our act on and hopefully this gets me a few gigs after footy with the way, uh, the way we act today. So just in positions, guys, and action. Cut. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, uh, here we have Steel making him a little bit prettier than what he usually is. Steel. I think he's asleep, actually. You're late, man. But how you going, man? My chest is then a little sore, to be honest. Yeah, mate. Uh, Push ups, not my forte. Um, especially, I don't usually get out of the park and I kind of jump and do push ups. So. Yeah, I do usually. Yeah. Most days off, I usually float around in my footy gear hoping someone will recognise me. <laughs> he's asleep again, you wouldn't believe it. Oh, he's away. Tough day, man. you got a bit of a sweat up. Have you ever acted before? A couple of times. What have you done? Um, like school concerts and that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Any plans to hit the big stage after? Footy? Wouldn't have thought, no, probably not. But who knows? A lot of time from now to then, so let's see how we go. Alright, guys, here we are just wrapping up the uh, Masashi ad. Uh, keep an eye out for us, um, auditioning for Home and Away after this. I've got the bug, so. I might shoot off to LA and see if I can get an acting role somewhere over there. Um, so look out for the ad and uh, hope we did use proud. <laughs> 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 <laughs>